Problem number three, again, is similar to what I said about number two, but we do have the inequality. So we should start with 2x minus 7 is greater than or equal to 3, and 2x minus 7, turn the inequality around, negative 3. Solve each one of these separately. Add 7. So x is greater than or equal to 5. Here, do the same problem. 2x less than or equal to positive 4. So x is less than or equal to 2. So we'll have a 0 right here. We have a 2. And we have our 5. x is less than or equal to 2. So we draw a circle. We fill it in. And we would have our shaded region going south or going west. And x is greater than or equal to 5. Circle it in at a 5. And it would be going this way. So if x is greater than 5, that satisfies this one right here. x is greater than 2 would be for between here and here, so that doesn't work. Answer C, x is greater than negative 5. From negative 5 keeps going here, so it starts off being in the right area, but it includes this area, so that's no good. x is less than or equal to 5. That would, not, that would include this area, so that one's no good x is less than or equal to 2, that's this one here, and x is less than or equal to negative 2, uh, so that would start at negative 2 and go down, so that one does satisfy the inequality, however it doesn't include all the values, none of them do.